Now to some other stories we're following tonight. Let's get you up to speed. Rescheduled. The TSA says more than 1 million travelers passed through airport security yesterday. But even with the increase in passengers, Delta Airlines, based in Atlanta, has canceled nearly 300 flights since then. The airline told us in a statement a number of factors made it difficult to staff those flights. It started making adjustments yesterday, and most passengers were placed on alternative flights within hours of their original itinerary. Back in Georgia, the man accused of beating a woman and he met on a dating app was extradited back to this state to face charges. Officers arrested Benjamin Fancher in New York last week. The victim's lawyer says 31 the, says 31 year old was about to go on a date with another woman in New York mm. when police picked him up there. Sold underground Atlanta as a new owner, once again, North Cross Real Estate and Gaming Executive Chanel Lalani bought the property. This is according to our partners at the Atlanta Business Chronicle. Underground Atlanta was, was home to the city's New Year's peach drop for years, but a company bought it from the city in 2017 with plans to create high-end dining, shopping, and residential district, but that has not happened so far.